it may be cold, but if you are looking for a reason to get outside, here are five free art installations throughout the city that are sure to warm your soul. First up is Kenseth Armstead's Boulevard of African Monarchs in Harlem. The installation is meant to remind viewers of Harlem's creativity as it celebrates the legacy of African excellence in America. The piece proclaims Black Lives Matter in three dimensions. Boulevard of African Monarchs is the first sculpture in the Sankofa project. Sankofa means go back and get it. The installation will be on display until August 2021 at 116th Street and Adam Clayton Powell Jr. Boulevard. Now let's head to the meatpacking district for Tom Fruin's latest creation, Bumbora House. Located in Gansevoort Plaza, the piece is meant to convey messages of hope, stability, and joy, and urge viewers to take in their surroundings with a fresh perspective. Fruin collected fragments of retail signage, disposed theater props, plastics, and metals to create something beautiful from nothing. You can't miss the bright colors during the day, and at night, LED lights illuminate the house with an interactive design. The installation is up through March. Next up is Doors for Doris, which marks the threshold between Central Park and Midtown Manhattan. Sam Moyer created a massive three-part sculpture with a title that pays tribute to Public Art Fund founder Doris C. Friedman. Doors for Doris examines how our culture values and utilizes materials. Moyer gathered discarded marble remnants from renovation projects and stone yards around the city. The stones display the unique colors, patterns, and geological history of their sources that include quarries in Brazil, China, India, and Italy. The installation encourages us to consider the diverse character of our city and our lives within it. The doors will be open until September 2021. Next is New York City's very own version of Anish Kapoor's Cloud Gate in Chicago, aka The Bean. The long-delayed version is nearly complete. It's located at the foot of the Jenga Lake building at 56 Leonard Street. The mirrored bean will inflate outwards from the base of the tower toward the sidewalk as if it were being squashed. And finally, let's head to Brooklyn Bridge Park for reverberation, giant orange bronze bells that are now ringing. The Public Art Fund unveiled the exhibition of large-scale bells by San Francisco-based sculptor Davina Simo. Reverberation consists of five four-foot-tall bright orange bronze bells housed in 14-foot-tall structures at Pier 1 along the waterfront. The five bells are individually titled Dreamer, Listener, Mother, Reflector, and Singer, each with a unique configuration of holes drilled through their surfaces to produce a different sound. The diverse sounds are symbolic of the city's diverse ideas and voices. According to Simo, this collective action invites visitors to reconnect with each other through the ringing of the bells, reconsidering how we engage and communicate with one another. So there you have it, five different ways to see free art this winter.